So here is an update. This, uh, my phone ran out of space when I was recording yesterday and I didn't exactly see that that had happened. So you, what you guys missed was cutting these out, cutting the pipes, fitting everything. Um, actually ran into a bit of an issue with the hydraulic cylinder mounting bracket had to redesign that and actually had to cut out different tines to move this hole from up there to down there. Um, but got everything mounted, tacked up into place like so. Uh, I got to go and cut some gussets from there to there on all of them and gussets for these top tines. But everything functions as it should. Wanted the top tines to come down and go at least halfway in there, like that. I didn't like the grapples that the tines only grab out here, like when they close. So. Wanted it to be able to come in a little bit. Um, still have to drill and tap for grease certs and weld these spacers to the tines. Uh, might might add some gusset in there, just a plate or something. Uh, Got to get hydraulic sil uh, hydraulic lines made up for that. And then see how it goes. But it works, works pretty good so far. I was gonna slide a piece of pipe through here, but after I ran the pipe there, there, and there, I didn't have enough, but it's not really necessary back there anyways, because most of your force is gonna be out here and on these top tines. So I want to make that beefy and the ends of that beefed up. So far, that's the progress. Um, next time you see it, it'll probably be, you know, functioning and all welded up, painted on the tractor. This is just all quarter inch plate. That's quarter inch. That's three sixteenths, three by three square tube. And this is two inch ID pipe. So weighs a good good amount. Thanks for following along. Till next time.